Welcome to Window Cleaning Resources YouTube channel. I am Steve O, the Window Cleaner, and today we are going to talk about what water fed pole is best for you. WindowCleaner.com. Okay, so we're talking about what water fed pole is right for you. Here are four different water fed poles I've used pretty extensively, so I feel good about kind of giving you my thoughts on them, and they all kind of go into like different levels of water fed pole work. First, would be the Zero Micro. The Zero Micro is a 30 foot carbon fiber pole. This is just the basic model. This doesn't have any ultra high mod carbon fiber or just any high mod carbon fiber in general. So the nice thing about the Zero Micro is that it's very compact when you have it, all the pieces in, like so. So you see tight spaces are in a home, it's just really compact, very easy to get around with, very easy to put in any kind of car. And the really nice thing about the Zero Micro is that it can also be a traditional pole. So you can take your brush out, and Window Clean Resource has these pieces. Go right in the top, and then you can also open the fourth clamp and take out the Zero Trad pole, which you can use for like storefront work. So this is like, I would think the best water fed pole. If you're just getting into water fed pole, you're doing like two story commercial buildings or just homes, this would be the best water fed pole for you currently on the market. Okay, so then the Tucker pole, but this is a 45 foot Tucker pole, and this is a carbon fiber. And I believe on the outside here, um, kind of has like a 3K weave to it purely cosmetic to it but it makes it really smooth keeps having a really good look to it this pole I would say is best for like employees employees who are gonna be really just tough with the equipment throwing it down a lot throwing it in the back of the truck it is pretty heavy but overall pretty rigid at 45 feet not the most rigid pole but overall would be a great pole for employees next what I would go into is the Phantom water fed pole. So the Phantom is made by Facelift. And the really cool things about these clamps is these clamps also come on some of the zero lines right now. So these clamps are probably some of the best clamps on the whole entire market. What I really like about them is they're just super smooth in and out, just really easy to use, very user friendly. The great thing about this pole is that everything is super smooth. So you see there, super smooth to go in and out. So if you're you know, collapsing your water fed pole, you're on a building, you can literally, so you're up in the building, you can literally just let that release. That's how easy these clamps move in and out. That's partially because of the 3K on the outside of here. That's super, super smooth. It just has a really good look to it. It's a little bit heavier. This is just basic carbon fiber. They have ones that do have the high amount of carbon fiber if you're interested, but you'll get more of a texture like these have right here on the outside of it. So next though, so you know, these two are great for you know commercial buildings, sometimes anywhere up to four, four floors, three story buildings, houses that have windows that are maybe close to 40 feet or over 30 feet where the zero micro may not work. The other nice thing about the Zero Micro is that they do sell a universal 10 foot extension if you need that extra 10 feet and you're finding on jobs you need it a lot. Now here's the thing, you could buy you know, a Zero Micro for your homes and then you could have a, a 40 foot Phantom or you could have a 45 foot Tucker, a 55 foot Tucker, a 65 foot Tucker. But the really nice pole that I really, really would encourage you buying, it's gonna be the most expensive at first is a ultra high modulus pole. This is the Zero Pro Gold Ultimate 40 foot ultra high mod pole. Why would I say that this pole is gonna be the best one? It's a 40 foot pole and it is just super light. I mean, the nice thing about this is it's gonna be lighter than a 30 foot micro and that you can still do groundwork, never be tired extend it to 40 feet to another window, do that, extend all the way back down, and just never be tired. If you're using poles like this or like this on ground floor work, you're gonna be tired. Sure, you can take away pieces, 
But with this, you won't ever have to take away pieces because it's so light, you can save the time of breaking down a water-fed pole and just have this. Now, this is the really great thing. If you're finding, okay, I've got a 40-foot I-modulus pole. Now, what you can do is you can get the extensions. So this is a, um, this is a high mod. It's not ultra high mod, but it's a very, very rigid high modulus extension. They also make this same pole just made out of this. So this is just high modulus, not ultra high mod, but still very light and very rigid. What you're gonna do here, You're gonna slide that on, lock that on. Once you bring out the bottom here, just a little bit, you can fully make this go to there, okay? So now, you have created a 50 foot water fed pole that's super, super light. So if I was gonna like fully extend this, which we'll just do right now for fun. I'll show you guys how much area you can cover with this pole and still have a super, super light pole. So now we have a 50 foot water fed pole. My module is covered by the pole, ultra high mod. Now here's the thing with ultra high modulus poles. They're not gonna be as rigid as, they're not gonna be as rigid as just a high modulus pole. So at this, you're gonna see a little bit of flex in the pole. You're gonna see a little bit of flex in any pole that's going to 50 feet or above, even at 40 feet. It's just very uncommon to get a perfectly straight rigid pole at that distance. But for me, this would be the main pole that I would wanna buy because you're going to be able to do everything with it. You're going to be able to do ground floor work with it because it's so light. You're just going to be able to do everything you want with this pole. So you're done with the extension. Take it off just like that. I'll hand that to my camera woman. And we just put it all back together, starting from the bottom and collapsing it in. Super smooth, super easy to work with. Clamps super easy. No wasted energy there. And that quick, we have it back to a ground floor pole, just like that. So overall, what am I trying to tell you guys here and what water fed pole you should choose? For me, I know it sounds like, okay, yeah, you're making this video and of course you wanna tell us to buy the most expensive one. But I would seriously just think about investing in the ultimate high ultra high mod because it's going to be super light it's going to get you to most things it's extremely rare for me that we usually need a 50 foot water fed pole we really usually go to like fourth story and that's about it but usually with that it is more comfortable with a 50 foot water fed pole but if you're just beginning i would seriously think about getting the zero micro it's just perfect for that and then though if you have a big company and you have employees working either one of these poles are great i would first suggest the tucker and then the Phantom um, overall. The Phantom out of all these poles is the most rigid, um, is the smoothest in and out, but your lightest of course is gonna be the Zero Pro Code Ultimate with the Ultra High Mod. And then of course the next one would be the lightest would be the Zero Micro 30, but that's only a 30 foot and that's just that basic carbon fiber. So I hope some of this info has kind of helped you in kind of figuring out maybe what water fed pole is right for you. I know there can be a lot, a lot of questions when determining what water fed pole is right for you. So please reach out to any of the guys there at Window Cleaning Resource and they can really help you out in deciding which water fed pole is right for you. Until next time, have a good day and we'll talk to you soon. Bye-bye.